only on CBS2. So much for customer service. A local auto mechanic leaves a disparaging note to a customer on his receipt. CBS2's Inland Empire reporter Crystal Cruz is live in Riverside at the repair shop with details of the uh, rude receipt. Crystal. Yes, this rude receipt sort of gone viral. The customer posted it on social media. has gotten a lot of mixed response regarding this receipt tonight. We'll let you decide who's in the right or the wrong. Oftentimes, the only thing shocking on a receipt from a mechanic is the price of the work done. But this receipt has a different sort of stunner on it, aimed at customer Ruben Rodriguez. I saw the words uh, stupid and, and I just kind of was like, what? So I read it, reread it. There it is, scribbled at the bottom of the receipt, customer too stupid to understand normal thinking, written by George Fritz. Please. The owner of George Fritz Auto Repair in Riverside. Ruben is quick to point out this grammatical error. Fritz used the wrong too and too stupid. There should be another O. Yeah, that is uh, one of the issues that I pointed out to him when I went back in the store. And I don't think he was too excited about that, but I did my best to help him out. Ruben says he was given the nasty gram yesterday when he questioned some previous work done to his car by George. But as you can see in the bottom, uh, it does say customer advice uh, again about keeping oil clean, which I'm not sure how to do that. That was my question. Um, customer is too stupid to understand normal thinking. If he's, you know, has a nerve enough or proud enough to write this on paper, then who else has he told, you know, and talked to this way? So I just felt that, you know, if you were treated this way by him, then, you know, he shouldn't get away with it. We talked to Mr. Fritz inside his office for about a half an hour, and the only comment he wanted me to release on the record was that he stands by his opinion of Mr. Ruben Rodriguez. Reporting live in Riverside tonight, I'm Crystal Cruz, CBS 2 News.